What up y'all and welcome to our channel. Today is a nice hot sunny day here in Sydney and we want to go out on an adventure and we want to take y'all along with us. So sit back, relax and enjoy this ride. But before you do, if you're not already a subscriber, hit that subscribe button. Also give us a thumbs up. Let us know that you really like this type of content. Also hit that bell notification to let you know when we putting stuff out so you don't miss out on any of our adventures. So let's get out on this road. Let's go. Everybody. So uh, we are on the road and we are going to make our way to Foster. Um, Foster is about a three and a half hour drive from Sydney and we're going there for the week. Mike and I, so Mike's our driver today. Um, it's Mike and I at the moment. Uh, I have a few meetings while I'm up there and Mike decided to come along and visit Foster again. Years ago, he used to do quite a bit of work up these ways, and because I've never been up this way before, well, to Foster, I've been Newcastle area, but I've never been to Foster. I thought, yeah, why not come along? You can do our driving since you kind of know your way. But anyway, since we have now, we're now on the road, um, and Mike has noticed that there are a lot of new roads now. He did say that the new road does cut off at least a good 45 minutes in travel but this trip alone traveling on this road is going to cost us $25 in tolls so that's us uh, we'll show some different parts of the video on our way to Foster and um, yeah sit back and relax and thanks for tuning in hey Mike hi so we're about an hour out of arriving into Foster and it's been a really nice drive. We're the only ones on the car on the road at the moment, right? Yeah. But it is a really nice drive and beautiful nature of Australia. Um, it's highway all the way. <clears throat> highway all the way, you'll see lakes on the way, um, what else did we see? Bridges, a little bit of traffic here and there, and just a lot of green forest. Yep. Like this is the Australia we wanted to see. But we're both getting sick. <laughs> Actually, he just got back from New Zealand not, what, two nights ago and he's come home, come back sick. And now I'm feeling sick. Got the, getting the sore throat. Anyway, we've checked ourselves, we're all good. I think we just need <coughs> a holiday. Yep. But yeah, we're an hour out from Foster. Um, our hotel has just called us to tell us that reception is closing at 6 p.m. We're gonna get there at a little after. So they've told us where they're gonna leave our room key. Um, <coughs> so we're gonna just uh, head to Foster check into our hotel and go and search for a place for dinner uh, we feel like pizza so we'll see if there's a nice Italian spot once we get there but this is us an hour out of Foster and it was just really nice looking at the sign seeing Brisbane and I said why can I be like shall we <laughs> 
we only got this car rental till Saturday so we'll just use it to enjoy our time around Foster but we'll if there are some other really neat uh, neat snippets of views from now until Foster we'll show you otherwise we'll see you guys when we arrive in Foster so this is the Tankery Township it is a really nice place really has everything you need looks like a really nice holiday destination and I'm guessing just ahead of us is the beach yes and Forster is really literally just around the corner just on the bridge um, Mike's gonna get out tomorrow and the next day to show more of the scenery and things and places to see and do but it is good it's just after 6 p.m. and we've almost arrived at our location <clears throat> we're gonna go settle into our hotel and then go and have some dinner this is the bridge this is the bridge the bridge yes. <laughs> this is the bridge that you go over so I'm guessing that's for Forster opposite us It is beautiful here. It is very, very nice. Look at that blue water. That beautiful yeah, features. the water's nice and blue. Can't wait to show the area and the places outside of the window of the car. You know, I feel like fishing chips now. <laughs> but it's like that you know when you go to a place where there's a beach and you always get hungry for fish and chips and I'm guessing there'll be some nice fresh fish around here so um, a lot of places that we've been eating fish and chips at since coming to Australia or Sydney they serve barramundi and I really don't like barramundi um, so anywhere that doesn't sell barramundi, I'm happy with. So we're now in Forster. There. Forster Laundry. We're here. So now we're just going to go look for our hotel. Um, and we'll check in with you when we get there. This is the little beast that we drove up on. She's good. I think she's good great on gas just as soon as I can see how much it took us to get up here but yeah uh, we'll, we'll have a play with that when we can and then I'll let you know uh, somebody hitched a ride with us I don't know who he is but yeah <laughs> stragglers <laughs> but yeah It was all, all in all great ride, great drive, and we enjoyed ourselves, so. So, we'll see. See what we can see when we get there. I thought I'd stop recording before, but anyway, this is where we stand. It's a nice place, nice hotel. I don't know where we just maybe went, but yeah. Beautiful. We're over here. Hello there. How can I help you? I'm with her. She just went in there. The lady just come in there and got the key. Okay. She's in 102, I think. Is okay, that 102? So with I'm okay. with her. Yeah. yeah. Hotel, shower, yes, toilet, nice big open shower. Little look, this is a nice little place considering we didn't have to pay for it. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. It's clean and the guy George at reception, he was amazing. He was like giving us 
a whole lot of different tips on the different places to eat here. <clears throat> and he would have kept going on, but the lady, the lady that was in there at the same time with me, she was like rushing him, like wanting to rush <laughs> to, for him to hurry, up. to hurry up. But he was nice. He was doing a really good job. <coughs> okay, so this us. We got tea and coffee. Ooh, cookies. I'm hungry. Yeah. Microwave. Any oh, milk? Fridge. Oh yeah. Some milk in there so we can have a coffee. Wherever that is. It's just the wardrobe. <laughs> Good, we got extra pillows. So this is clean and comfortable. It's not a five star, but I'm thinking the kettle is up here somewhere. Yep, <coughs> kettle and toaster is up the top. Cool. So we might have to go to the grocery store. Mm. You'll get a few things, but yeah, first things first is empty, empty the bladder. <laughs> do they have an Aldi here? Uh, which I do. Uh, they do. I think they do. Oh, I'm gonna stop yeah, I can't. I can't see myself. I told you I got to have light. There we go. When when uh, when trying to see me in this camera, you got to have some light. Cause if you don't have no light, you don't see me. All you see is a shadow. But anyway, we're gonna get ourselves settled in here and uh, get ourselves down to the local grocery so we can get some things for the room, and we're gonna go check out. <coughs> a local eatery. You know me. It's that time. So we'll see you soon. For tonight is the Sicilian. Um, we've come to an Italian restaurant. We're just waiting for our seat or table to be ready. We didn't make a booking, so they're just setting one up for us now. Mike feels like pizza. I feel like salad and maybe a pasta. So we're going to order up, wait for our table, and we'll let you guys know how we go. Okay, we made our order. We're getting a spicy chicken pizza <coughs> and a carbonara pasta. So once that comes out, we'll give y'all a, a taste. A taste. I'll, I'll be tasting it, but you can look at it all, all, as long as you like. But we'll give y'all a good look once it comes out, and then we'll let you know what we think. So stay tuned. We'll wait for our, for our dinner. Okay, people, our food has come out and I'm going to show. This is the spicy chicken pizza that I got. Man, because we outside and the wind just blowing it, just look like it's blowing the rocket that <laughs> off it. And this is the pasta that Lil got. That's the cabanara. Cabanara pasta that Lil has. It so looks like curry. We're gonna get into that. <clears throat> so Mike was too hot to sit in the restaurant. <clears throat> and we had like a really nice spot and the, near the window. And he was like, can we sit outside? It's too hot in here. <laughs> so we're now out in the wind, but it's beautiful. Anyway, enough complaining. Let's let's get into this. Yeah. All right. All right. Oh. First things first. Did you say Yes, I did. Yeah. <laughs> this ain't coming out right. <laughs> oh well. Half a piece in there. No chicken on this. As we do pizza. Yeah. 
so the cabanara is okay. Um, it's just okay. Considering this is not very, it's a nice big bowl, I think. <laughs> but it's just okay. I can make a better one. Okay. The pizza has that nice cheese pool, which was great. That's what I'm looking for when I have my okay. pizza. Uh, that's right. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah, it's just okay. I have definitely tried better in other places, but I guess we've got to eat it all now. Um, but this place is packed. <clears throat> you do, if you ever come here, you do need to book a table. We were just lucky there were only two of us, so we had to wait. Oh. And no one wants to sit outside besides us and another couple. Because it's nice and windy. Thank you for it. Yeah. But let's eat dinner. <clears throat> After this, I want to go somewhere to get a cake, a piece of cake. And this guy's like, you will go to Woolies and you can take it back to the room. So we got to find a place to have dessert. So we'll see. We'll see. Right. <clears throat> Let's see. Okay, people. We're full. I still so, got the whole. She still got a lot to go, so do I. But I think I'm more tired from the drive than anything else. So, we're going to get this to go because I know us. We'll probably go back to our hotel have a nap and then wake up hungry so we got this to eat so we'll see y'all another time i'm not having a nap it's gonna be bedtime anyway we'll see y'all in another time so for tonight take care and we'll see you tomorrow so we just left the restaurant italian restaurant right by the beach yes it's a beautiful place um what's it called sicily the sicilian the sicilian honestly the food was that is one thing mike and i don't normally like to do is to talk badly about food at places but that was one of the worst place that was not tasting the, that foods. was not the best place no like the Cabanara tasted like a seafood chowder just without seafood and the seafood taste. The sauce was like really watery. But anyway, um, <clears throat> if you like Italian food and you're in Forster, um, I would suggest not ordering. Like maybe other items on the menu are good. But I would suggest if you're a real Cabanara fan, don't order their Cabanara. We don't know of any other Italian places. This was a suggestion from the guy at the hotel that we're staying at. But if you ever come here and you're a Cabanara person, I would suggest not ordering it. Maybe try something else on the menu. And if you like chicken pizza, again, I would suggest um, <coughs> ordering something else. Yeah, uh, it just wasn't the best. Like and their prices are pretty steep, so considering the price to the quality of the food it was definitely wasn't the greatest place to go um on the way here we drove past the seafood like a fish and chip shop and i said to mike let's go for fish and chips he's like no i want italian a pizza so as soon as our food came out and we went to eat it 
I looked at him I said see we should have went to fish and chips have fish and chips but anyway we didn't even eat half of our food and um, <clears throat> yeah it just wasn't the best but anyway um, I'm not sure if we're gonna end this video right now but we are gonna go and grab a few things from the supermarket because of that dinner I don't feel like dessert anymore so we'll see I just want something to wash that down to get it out of me. That's all I want. <laughs> Never know. It doesn't matter. We're gonna get there. We're gonna go I in the water. We're gonna idea. yes. We're gonna we're gonna get wet today. So who knows? I'll be at the beach twice today. So you know. And I'll see y'all when I get there. All right. Get him first guy, you reckon? Mm. Get him first guy. Mm. What did you get? I couldn't resist. He had.